What's going on guys? Nate here with 4K Motoring. Uh, today's video is going to be a little bit off topic, but uh, there's a story that goes along with it and it really pisses me off. So we are going to install a new lights at my buddy Chris's house. Um, he recently had an electrician come over he hired uh, Michael and Sons electricians yes I'm gonna drop their name because they uh, I think it's absolutely ridiculous what they did um, so he just needed two new garage lights mounted um, up there that's the one that they did the one that's working and then the other one over there you can see it only one bulb is working and it's actually very dim um, on camera it looks like it's working but it's really dim but anyway so he called them and told them he needed these lights replaced he didn't want to do it himself because it's it's a uh, um, it's like an 11 foot ceiling um, and he doesn't have a really big step ladder so he called them to do it he didn't think it would be very expensive um, they told him they would come and do it and uh, give him a price when they got there once they looked at what they had to do um, When they got here he was in a meeting with work. He couldn't talk with them. So his girlfriend um, Gave them the go-ahead um, When they told her how much it was going to be They charged him nine hundred dollars is what they were going to charge him to do both lights. $900. 20 minutes later, he came downstairs, um, asked his fiance, Sam, Samantha, how much it was for them to do the work. She told him how much it was. He immediately went into the garage and told them to stop and to leave because that price was absolutely outrageous. In 20 minutes, they were already done with that light right there. And He's like, well, take it down. I don't want it because I'm not paying $900 for these two lights. Um, so, and all in all, if they had done both lights, it would have taken them less than an hour and they would have charged him $900. We found those same exact lights at, I don't remember if it was Lowe's or Home Depot, but it was a two pack for $86. So for less than an hour of labor, they were charging $800. So I don't know if the electrician was thinking he was doing surgery instead of connecting two or three wires and turning a couple screws, but it's absolutely ridiculous. So when I found that out, I was like, dude, you know, you could have called me. I could have done it very, very easily. Um, I have a big ladder. Um, I, it wouldn't take me long at all. Um, so here I am gonna do his other light for him. But instead of a, uh, an LED strip light like that is, I've been wanting to try out those uh, like clover lights, the LED clover lights. Um, so I found one on Amazon. I haven't opened it yet, um, but we're going to try that out. It was a two pack. They were on sale for $22. They're supposed to be uh, 4,000 lumens each bulb. Um, so it should be pretty good. I think I looked those up right there and they were only rated at 2000 lumens for one of those. So it should be double the brightness. I don't know how close the rating is. Um, it had really good reviews. It was lifetime warranty. Uh, I read all the, the first two pages of reviews. Nobody seemed to have any problems with them. So I decided to go ahead and give them a shot. I haven't opened them yet. Um, they're in the box down there. Let's go ahead and do that now. All right, so this is the package. I just got it today about maybe about an hour or two ago. Um, it is made in China, which I think freaking everything's made in China today. But uh, two pack of these little clover lights. Um, let's get it out of the bag. It's all plastic. It uh, doesn't feel like anything special. Um, it just has a regular bulb fitting, um, so it would fit into any standard outlet. Um, but 
All right, let's uh, go ahead with the install. Okay, so um, my camera is running out of, well, it had run out of space. I deleted some stuff, um, but that's comparison from the LED strip lights, the four foot, and then the $20 Amazon light that did not cost $800. Um, so it's, it's really bright. I'm, in, I'm pretty impressed, uh, especially for a $10 bulb as opposed to a $50 fixture. Um, we will see how long it lasts. Um, there's Chris's A5 S line. Um, maybe we'll be doing some videos on that in the future. Sure, if you want. I think that light was, I think you said it was 80 bucks as well. Remember we found the two pack for $80. Oh, did you? Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm pretty sure I sent it to you. And there's Sadie Pups just hanging out. All right, well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Okay.